Hey, what's going on guys? DJ Taxman here. Welcome to the channel. I finally got a camera. Let's get into this. We got another chess game. Hopefully we can uh, come away with another win. Alright, right now we're on 1294 and we're versing 1292 so it's only two differential in rating points. So it should be a close match. Uh, so yeah, if we draw, we don't move anywhere. If we win, we go up 44. If we lose, we go down 44. Alright, get my queen involved early, that's what I like to do. Put him under pressure with the check. Let's see what he goes. He wants to just trade straight away. I like my queen, I'm going to decide to keep it. I'm going to move it across because now there's nothing defending this pawn, so if he doesn't notice that, I can go out and attack it. Alright, yep, so he did see that which is fine because now I can pin his horse which he didn't stop which is good for us All right, so he's going to go on the attack there that's fine doesn't really bother us I'm going to move down here as an extra option to attack that horse and unfortunately he's disconnected so hopefully he doesn't uh, leave, hopefully he can reconnect and we can play him. Brian from the United States. And if he did disconnect then we'll just jump into another game. Uh, we do get the win I believe if this goes because he re ends up auto resigning. So uh, I'll count the game and we'll just move on really. There's not much we can do. Okay guys, he did end up resigning, so we're just going to jump into a new match. Uh, we ranked up to 1338 from that. Uh, so a nice little boost, and now we're versing Wayburn from Canada. And we're starting off, and he's on 1344, and we're now 1338, so it's another close match. And let's see what we want to be doing here. Put that pawn under. That's fine, we can trap his horse. Let's see, most likely we'll bring yeah, the pawn up there. The bishop, I'm afraid, sorry. Uh, let's see, what do we want to do now? I think we just go for the take. Castle. And let's see. Ball's in his court. I'm going to try and, I want to get rid of this pawn, to be honest. It's quite pesky. Alright, so he, he might try and bring his bishop out. That's fine. He's going to try and start to castle, I think, because we have already castled. So he does decide to take that. So he is going for the castle. good he's eating up a lot of the clock which means we can go down and beat him on time which you know when it is a win and not sure why he did that because now he's under some pressure all right that's fine just take him there I'm not worried about that at all he's doing a lot of trades Fine by us. Alright. I'll just set my castle up. Try and attack this pawn. He's most likely going to have to move it. Probably put the pawn up there. Yep. It's fine by us. Just move my castle up one more. Protecting this pawn if he tries to take it. And then we can also swing this castle back. Alright, what's he going to go for now? Uh, he's 
It's going to go for the defense up there, which is not a bad move. We want to free our pawn up, but we do want to keep. We want to get our horse out. Start making moves with it. All right, so he's going to move his horse up. That's fine by us. Where can he go? There he gets taken. There, I suppose. Which I'm not too worried about. There, you can't do. Put pressure on his horse. Just go for the swap if we need it. I feel like I'm in a bit of a better position than he is. Yep, so he's going to just switch it there. Just, that's alright. And I'll just put some pressure on. Try and take this pawn there. Unless he sees that. Which he does and he reacts to it. Which is fine. Because now... What do we want to do? I suppose... We'll start to advance this guy up. Alright. There's no dramas there. Don't want to do that. Don't want to do that. Don't want to do that. I guess I'll just bring him back to here. So he can't check. going to move it up even forward, that's alright, we want to block that, and it also gives us, our king, a bit of an escape route, in case he tries to check us along here, uh, later in the game. Alright, so he's moved his queen, looking for an attack, that's fine, might be trying to take that pawn, which I can just block. And he taken he took that one, which is fine. Cause now kinda wanna get him out of the way, but I'm gonna move this guy here. See how he reacts to that. Alright, so he's going to take my pawn there. Not sure why I did that. Oh, well, that's why I did that. <laughs> Wasn't really paying too much attention there. Let's move him across. Alright, it's quite a close game, well it's not a close game anymore, he's plus three, close to game when we're both uh, on the similar times, and now he's just going to try and poach my pieces. So what do I want to do? I think I'll move there, thread in that piece. Well, I could also take that if he moves it across. Which he does do. game today, not paying attention, making really silly mistakes, uh, it's not looking good for us here, just try and put some pressure on, it's really all I can do.
Yeah, things aren't looking good for us. We're now plus. He's got plus nine on us, and he's going on the attack. So we might be in trouble soon. Let's see what he does. He might can't move that back. So we, I think we can get this one. He could move it. His castle there to try and protect it. But we're just gonna have to see what he does. We'll, we'll fight it out. And just do our best and try and learn from our mistakes. Really. A bit of a blunder. It's a bit hard when you get thrown into a higher rated game where you're not meant to be. When we didn't really play the game to win this, to deserve the moving up in ranking. Alright, so let's move that out of the way. And I'll just take that. And he's put me in check. So I'm going to move that forward. Because I think he was going for the checkmate. Which I didn't want to do. Now he might try and attack my pawn there. Yep. In which case I can protect it. So he's taking his time to think with these moves, so if we keep playing it out, we could win on time if we keep putting him into things where he's trying to think about it too much, but being down nine pieces in terms of ranking points, it's uh, it's not a good, nice idea. Right. So I was going for the double up there, in which case, what can we do here? Yeah. What do we want to do here? I guess we have to move out of the way. We'll take his pawn. He's going to, I think, trade a horse and a pawn. Which I don't think is that smart. Um, because he might be in a bit of trouble here. If we can manoeuvre our way out of this. See, he's lost rankings there. It's only plus seven now. And if we can, we might be able to get our pawn up here and get an advance it to a queen. Alright, so now he's gone down. Which is fine. I think that's the best move is to start advancing our pawn up. So he's gone for the check. Which is sort of fine by us. Might go for the check here, so I can just move my pieces around. Uh, he's going for a check there now, which is okay. Just keep moving my king. for another check which is fine by us again and another check that's alright we'll just keep letting him play around with it check. <laughs> so I guess we will move our king back. That's pretty much the only place we could do. I suppose we could have taken his pawn actually, which might have been able to help us. Yep, so that was the mistake. I should have taken the pawn there. Because I just 
I just wasn't thinking really. As you can see, I made 10 blunders. I had one missed win, so we could have pulled that off. Um, maybe if I thought about it a little bit more. But that's the game, isn't it? So we're just going to have to come back. We're on a flat 1300, so we still went up over the uh, episode. Not a bad way to end it. Thanks for watching, guys. Leave a comment if you want to see more.